Hello everyone, I am Swami Gaur, class 9th, Rashtrakti Vidyal. Today I had planned an art integrated activity from the class 9th science. I had taken this topic from the chapter Why Do We Fall Ill? And in this project, I learned the virus is very dangerous to us. But we can prevent ourselves from this virus when we are taking safety measures and we are following some guidelines. Now I made this project with the help of some old newspapers, mastics, created this ball like structure to give more realistic look I used colors. And this whole process was a joyful learning to me because I learned many aspects of virus. Hello everyone, I am Toshito Jainwal of class 8C of Rasha Shakti Vityale. and today I am going to do the odd integrated activity of science. And in this video, I am going to give you some important and interesting information about viruses. Viruses are also a type of microorganisms, but they are the smallest of all the microorganisms. They are also considered as the borderline between living and non-living, as they act completely inactive outside the host body. But when they enter the host, they reproduce very very fast. Some examples of viruses are HIV virus, COVID-19 and polio virus. Hello everyone, I am Nitika Sharma of class 8C from Rashtri Vidyalaya, going to perform an art integrated activity in front of you. The topic of my activity is virus, so let's begin with our topic. They are very small in size or tiny organism on the world. They reproduce only when they are inside the host body means when they are outside the host body they are in the non-living form and that's why they set to the borderline between living and non-living. Their size varies from 0.015 micron meters and they are seen only with a special type of microscope known as electron microscope. They have a cellular structure but do not have a genetic material like DNA. When they are outside the host body, they are in the crystallized form also. Their size varies from cuboidal, spherical, geometrical, etc. And it can affect anything which is present on the earth. Let's discuss. Hello everyone, my name is Kushi Gupta and I am from Rasha Jakti Vidyale and I study in 9th standard. Today I am going to recite a poem in front of you all and its title is Think Like a Scientist. I want to think like a scientist, observing animals earth or sky i want to ask good questions wondering how what and why i want to make smart guesses hypothesizing what might happen and when i want to do cool experiments testing my thinking again and again and i want to write up all my data recording pictures charts and words i want to think through all i have done drawing conclusions and what ab about i have learned wondering, asking and testing conclusions. This is what scientists do. If you want to think like a scientist, you must do this all too. Thank you.